editing and deleting user-defined functions. So we'll go into main and um, uh, I think I may have a function already existing in f of x. Let's have a look. We'll go to the keyboard down to math3 and we'll ask classpad for f of x uh, by typing in f of x. And yes, it's already defined. Now, um, if I wanted to change it, the simplest way is simply redefine it. So I could either use the interactive define method or I'm already here on Math 3, so I can pop the word define. I can take a copy of f of x down and say it's now maybe going to be a quadratic x squared um, minus 2x plus 3 minus 2x plus 3 and tap execute. And it's simply overwritten. So now if I take a copy of f of x down here, tap execute, it's now become, it's basically just overwritten. So there's basically nothing to worry about. That's the simplest way to deal with most commonly sort of fgh of x type of functions. However, if you wanted to edit it, um, rather than totally redefine it that way for some reason, then we can access them through the program part of the calculator. So if we tap on menu and swipe over to the next screen where we can find the program, um, then if we tap edit open file and change the type from programs to functions and click OK, uh, well, not quite yet. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yep. Just check from the drop down box that the file you want is the one there. So there's f of x. Let's take that one. Then classpad says here's your function called f. The variable is x and here it is. So we could change that. Maybe we'll just tack a zero onto the end of it, for example. So um, and then when we hit save or tap on edit file save, the same kind of thing. Let's see what's happened. So we'll go back to main and tap on f of x and execute. And you can see now it's been updated there. So we can um, edit it, but it's probably just easier to override it. Eh? Now, deleting a function, um, if you for some reason need to use the variable f in an, uh, something, then um, often having it defined as a function is going to upset class pads. So to find where these functions are stored, if we tap on to the settings at the top here and head into the variable manager, and just most of the time you'll find your variables live in this main folder. So we're going to tap twice to get into there. And here are my variables. Now here's the one we want to get rid of. So I simply select the box, tap on to edit, delete, OK, and now F is gone. So um, it's that easy and it's a good idea to come in here fairly frequently and um, anything you're not sure about or you don't like the look of, you simply select the boxes, edit, delete, OK, and everything's gone. So we'll close that, close that. Now if I ask ClassPad what f of x is, so I'll just tap execute there, you'll see it's just saying, well, it's just f of x. It actually hasn't been defined.